Now remember, Peter, don't touch this money until you get to the grocery store. Then buy one can of beans and come straight home. Do you understand? Lois, I'm a guy you can trust with a task. I'm the one who almost conquered the dragon's lair. Diamond engagement ring? <gasps> oh, my God! That's right! I bought a horse! You bought a horse? Why the hell did... I didn't even give you that much money. That's what I thought, Lois. Whatever, Peter. Fine. Keep the horse. Good. This family works much better when we're unified. You'll see. This horse will be a fine addition to our family. You know what? I don't want him to feel self-conscious. Everybody pee. He knows standing behind me. Hey, you want a sugar cube horsey? Oh, oh God, Brian, don't! Oh, oh, ew, ew, ew. Maple Drive, otherwise we won't make the movie on time. All right. Uh-oh. What is it? Uh, the horse is right behind the car. Peter, that thing is just creepy. Hey, scat! Oh, that's got all my stink of the day in it. That's nasty. Know it! I got a sixth sense about these things. Remember when I predicted the ending, the wild hogs? This movie's gonna suck. <laughs> Even though he's got a race, he couldn't hold it. Mm-hmm. And they're off! Go, horsey, go! God, it even runs like it's messed up in the head. Picking up the rear, but somehow still in the race, is Till Death. You named your horse Till Death? You know why? Because I'm gonna take this horse and shove it down America's throat. What's this? It looks like Till Death has taken a right turn and is heading in... Wait a sec. Hold the phone. He's going back towards the track. Fellas, this race ain't over yet. No! My baby's dead! It's over. When it was just a flaming bag of poop and a hurtful note. I have no idea how the hell we're gonna pay for this, Peter. Well, I'll just have to get a second job or something. Hand me the classifieds. Hey, Lois, look at this. Subject wanted. I'm your neck. What are you gonna do, choke me? You'll die. You'll die if you do that. Can somebody from wardrobe get me a scarf? Oh, I'm still gonna... I I'll just talk louder. Ben Affleck married Jennifer Garner, but you married a bartender with a kid. <laughs> okay, what's next? This is the Seth Rogen gene. It will give you the appearance of being funny even though you haven't actually done anything funny. And not a matter of choice or environment. Are you crazy? I don't want to take a chance on being gay. We'll give you $125. All right, I'll do it. Boy, you're more persuasive than James Bond. Now, time for some unfinished... Good, Lois. So good. I'm going to squeeze right in here if my thighs will let me. <laughs> Peter, what exactly did they inject you with? Oh, all sorts of things. Hepatitis vaccine, a couple of steroids, the gay... Did anybody see that absolutely fabulous piece on Fiji in yesterday's travel section? Oh. Well, now, wait a minute, Meg. Let's not be too hasty. These are delicious. What? I said homosexuality is wrong. Are you... Are you being serious right now? How many rotations of guys will it take before everybody's had a turn? I don't know. Nine, with a remainder of Brent. Oh! Guys, Brent can't fit in the glory hole, and that's why we all like Brent. You know, Peter, with all the shopping and cooking and decorating, I have to say I'm really liking the new you an awful lot. An awful lot. <laughs> what? What, what, are, what are you doing? Packed. <laughs> <laughs> Just tell me, Doctor, is there anything you can do to remove this gene? Well, Mrs. Griffin, it doesn't really work that way. We just have to wait for the effects to wear off. Hey, Meg, so we're all just gonna have to get used to this and learn to accept your father for who he is now. Oh, great plan, Lois. Hey, here's a nutty idea. Ever read the Bible? Leviticus 18.22. Stewie, you're judgmentally quoting Bible verses and you don't even know how to read. <laughs> I miss Peter so much. Gay or not, I just wish he was still here. You just make me want to be a gayer man. Oh, come here. And you don't miss your wife at all? Well, sure I do, but this is a whole new chapter in my life, Scott. And that chapter is all about you. 
God, I feel so bad for Lois. She really misses Peter. I'm Carter Pewter Schmidt. Oh, my God. So I got another guy working on finding out who that is. It's my father. Oh, this is a twist I did not expect. Oh, excuse me. I'm just going to have to hold this out until I'm not surprised anymore. Mm. I'm okay if it's like coconut flour, but anything with actual grains, I can't do. I'm not sure. Well, who is sure? People magazine from home and not from your waiting room just now, and why did you cancel a Christmas carnival? Because I hate Christmas. You know what it's like being rich at Christmas, Griffin? Everyone expects an expensive present, and I get nothing. Did you, did you just have your hand in my fish tank? By an officer with the law, his will just said, kick Jimmy in the sack for me. Go Eagles. My sympathies, Vinny. Don't worry about it. He was a scumbag. Are you sure about this, Peter? I mean, I know Stewie was disappointed about the carnival, but he'll get over it. He's a- Hey, knock it off! I'm touching this, and this over here, you're a creep is my point. All right, Carter, now you know what's guaranteed to put you in the holiday mood? Write a Christmas letter to all your friends and relatives. Because that's what gives the newsletter credibility. Now, everyone knows the best way to get the Christmas spirit is to drink a whole lot of thick, frothy eggnog. So get going. I don't like eggnog. Drink the nog, Carter. I, I don't... I don't want to. Okay, Carter, a big part of Christmas is masturbating like you would any other day, but feeling guilty about it because it's Christmas. Uh, what's wrong with me? Oh, this Christmas carnival has everything. Games, food. Oh, my God, it's the carolers from a Christmas story. Dad, Mary Lou Gallo. She had a look. But when you got up close, she also had a smell. Oh, Stewie, you're next. Ho, ho, ho. Mall Santa is brought to you in part this season by Chipotle. Between good and garbage, it's... I don't care about this stupid carnival or Christmas. I don't care about anything except Brian. I want Brian. <laughs> you want me to put a dead dog under your tree? <laughs> what are you doing, Vinny? Vinny? Who's Vinny? My name is Brian, a.k.a. your favorite dog. Hey, whose leg do you got a gargoosh to get an amaretto di Serrano around here? Oh, forget it, Vinny. You're not Brian. Come on, I went through a lot of... You want to be a select man. You blew it. You wish you could open up a restaurant. You did not want to pay protection money. Knock, knock. Who's there? You blew it. You blew it who? You blew it bad. You know what the last page in the book is? I'm Giatelli is dead. Oh, no. They killed Frankie Choo Choo Chinelli instead. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a minute. You sure that's what this means? Could be they killed Davy the Box Fratelli. Ooh. Hold on. It could also be they killed... Park? Should that park be adjacent to a beach? Thanks. What? You don't like it? How's about we go to the mall and pick out something you do like? Well, I suppose I could browse the toy store. Possibly pick up a new action figure. That's the spirit. Keep right behind you. I played this as a kid. Of course, I had to do it with ashtrays, but I think the sheep is better. Wait a minute. Who is that? A Christmas toy. I don't understand, so I'm angry and hungry. I'm gonna go punch a sandwich. Wow, good timing, little fella. This just came out today. Uh, yeah, I kind of knew that already. The time machine return pad is in the... choice of me, but, uh... You ever do any modeling? Well, not professionally, but I, I, I have thought about it. You order. What are you, like 6'3", six, 6'4"? Six, uh, you, you're, you're, in, you're in the ballpark. I, I, I carry myself taller. Good posture, very important. You know, my friends ask me, Stewie, why do you throw up after every meal? This, this is why. We will never have met. I'll probably never see you again. Oh. So, I think this is goodbye. Hey, I'm man's best friend, not some stupid baby's best friend, right? You'd be sitting inside writing, you'd be working on one of your machines, but... Here we are enjoying it. Yes, it is a nice change of pace. Oh, wait, I gotta go grab my knee pads. I was using them for, for, for this other thing. Anyway, I'll be right back. 
for me from the past, so I stole his return pad and came back here. Oh, that reminds me, I've got to send this back where it came from. Hmm, starting to think that guy wasn't a real modeling agent. A pretty awesome guy. Oh, pretty awesome guy. Why don't you marry him, huh? All right, game on! Ah! <laughs> Stu S.A. Stu S.A. Stu S.A. Are we pregnant? What? No, Stewie, it's nothing like that. Okay, well, I have to tell you, I'm a little bit relieved. Look, just, just thanks for everything, Stewie. You're my best friend, and I love you. All I can say, Brian, is you've been making really creepy.